sharp tusks at the entrance to defend themselves against predators. They either make their own burrows or steal them from other animals. Now it looks like we're actually going to get a really close up view of those zebras up ahead. And the white rhinos as well towards the right of the pathway. It looks like there's some water buck with those zebras also. Now these are Grant's zebras and we can tell because their striping pattern goes all the way around their bodies and underneath their bellies. Both their skin and their hair is striped and the striping pattern is unique to each zebra. Now it looks like this white rhino ahead of us here might cross the right path. We get a good look from this left hand side, and there's one out to the right hand side there as well. Now, coming up on the right hand side, you'll see some water bug. Their shaggy coats produce an oily, smelly substance that helps keep their coats waterproof, and this is how they identify each other. We'll get a really good view of these zebras here. Now these Grant zebras are actually black with white stripes and we can tell because their noses are black. See, that's not just a joke. 